ఓం శాంతి ఎయిత్ డిసెంబర్ టూ థౌజండ్ ఎయిటీన్ సాటర్డే ద బ్లెస్సింగ్ ఫ్రమ్ టుడే సకార్ మురళీస్ మే యూ బికమ్ అన్ ఎంబాడిమెంట్ ఆఫ్ ఈజీ సక్సెస్ బై డూయింగ్ పవర్ఫుల్ సర్వీస్ త్రూ ద మైండ్ అలాంగ్ విత్ సర్వింగ్ విత్ వర్డ్స్ జస్ట్ యాజ్ యూ హ్యావ్ బికమ్ ఎక్స్పీరియన్స్డ్ ఇన్ బీయింగ్ కాన్స్టెంట్లీ బిజీ ఇన్ సర్వింగ్ విత్ వర్డ్స్ Similarly at the every moment along with serving with words let there also automatically be service taking place through your thoughts serving through the mind mansa seva means that you and others automatically feel the pure vibrations of having good wishes and pure feelings at every moment for every soul let there constantly be blessings emerging from your mind for all souls at every moment by serving through the mind the energy of your words will be saved and this powerful service through your mind will easily make you an embodiment of success baba is focusing on Mansa Seva, serving through the mind. Just as you have become very much experienced with verbal service in the similar manner, now serve through your thoughts. Serving through your mind means, so Baba has given two definitions of Mansa Seva and two benefits. so mensa seva has got two benefits two definitions and two benefits the first definition is good wishes and pure feelings and second definition is blessings and both of both of these things at every moment and both of these things for every soul and two benefits what are they energy of words saved and second success in service so mantra seva means when at all moments and for every soul there are good wishes and there are pure feelings and continuously blessings are coming out from our heart for every soul and at every moment benefits your energy of the world is saved and there is success in service you will easily become an embodiment of service so this is what baba says about mansa seva the time will come when there would be no time to do service through the words and even people will not have time for such service even to listen to you so that will be the time when you do only and only mansa seva what are the things which are in mansa seva not needed what things are not needed which are needed in verbal service there are certain things where you don't need those things and that's why this is a very easy seva very easy service easy and yet difficult because not everyone can do that only the mind which is very strong powerful can do mental service can do this service through the mind so what things are not needed in mensa seva yeah there are about 10 things which are not needed in mensa seva first of all instrument any sadhan or 
any external support any things any no sadhan is needed for mansa seva for your speech you need mic or sometimes you have to shout loudly or other things are needed but for service to the mind no sadhan external sadhan external uh, facilities external paraphernalia external things are not needed in mansa seva there is no need second is chance sometimes you may get chance for service through speech sometimes you may not but what about service through the mind mansa seva you don't need any chance you don't need that somebody should give you a chance to do it you can grab it the all chance is yours you have all the time at your disposal to do mansa seva your mansa seva doesn't depend on somebody's permission so you don't need anybody's permission so in mansa seva chance is not needed hmm no offer is needed no invitation is needed so chance third any support or aadhar no aadhar no support is needed first we said about sadhan and this is about any sort of any support for example speech uh, somebody doesn't know then he might have to learn he may take help of books or he, somebody else might teach him but mansa means just to have good wishes and automatically the mansa vibrations the vibrations through the mind spreading so because if you see the definition of mansa seva baba defined in two things first good wishes and second blessings just to have good wishes for anyone is that we are doing his mansa seva so special no aadhar is needed no external support is needed then fourth time for mansa seva you don't need any time <coughs> speech there is a time limit you have to stop but there is no time limit for mansa seva you can go on whole night or whole day or all the time for all the souls we need free time no sakshi ho jate hain drama so mansa seva is a very elevated service and as i said it is the easiest and yet it is the most difficult because not everyone can do mansa seva not everyone in today's sakar murli baba said every soul's power is different no so two souls power are same taqat do religion is might and you have understood it and you are powerful but no two souls are having similar power so in the similar manner for mansa seva you need a very strong mind you lead you need an unlimited attitude you don't need any attachment to anyone you need unlimited disinterest vairag for mansa seva and only those who have done almost all sorts of karmana seva physical service they alone one day is, are able to do this it's not that somebody comes and starts doing mansa seva for mansa seva to reach that stage of the mind you must have gone through everything all sorts of service all exhibitions center and uh, most of the menial services or physical works everything you should have given uh you should have done lot of service through the speech mansa seva is something standing here on the top of the mountain for that you need ha- you should have done almost everything though it appears that it is very simple but it is not simple because to have unlimited attitude if some of my relative is there i do more yoga for him and some distant person is there i become detached so that is not mansa seva people call up and they say my child is having some congenital 
disease what sakaj i should give to him or they say that i my husband is having this problem what sakaj i should give to him and they say that our somebody is suffering from this disease what sakaj i should give so they are limiting their sakaj to only one family member so so long as there is strong attachment there is no mansa seva mansa seva the very first criteria is total detachment from everyone then only the sakash works otherwise service through sakash is not so cheap it is very costly service you have to pay you have to pay you have to pay a lot in the service of sakash otherwise whatever you are giving sakash that is just the expansion of your attachment the person is here a is attached to b and now a is giving sakash to b this is no sakash at all at all this is illusion of sakash brahm that person is feeling my vibrations are going but actually these are not vibrations going this is the expansion and projection of his own attachment that's it they are just remembering that soul and nothing else <laughs> they are just that is also one of the means to remember that soul because otherwise also they are missing no so they are trying to fulfill that missing thing here so there is no sakash at all and that's why nothing happens the same they stay they stay the same and they are not accepting realities or facts of life recently somebody had come to us and uh, there was a child who was having mrcp mental retardation and cerebral palsy we are having mrcp patient is mentally retarded <coughs> less and physically deformed can't walk so there is a cerebral palsy so a lot of people bks have such patients so they make all efforts they go from one place to another place they sit specially for that soul that's good that we are giving sakash to such souls but then it should not be an expansion over of attachment under the guise of giving sakash we are in fact satisfying our own ego and our own deeper attachments so the fourth thing which is not needed in mansa seva is time you don't need time you can do mansa seva all the time because mansa seva is not actually a process it is not a process it is not an action it is not doing it is being being the stage of being and stage of doing physical thing is a stage of doing mansa is a stage of being to be an embodiment of good wishes for all i am not giving sakash to anybody i am just sitting and having good wishes for all to be in this stage is to give sakash there is no need for sending out or generating a particular thought that i am giving sakash to this soul and that soul no need automatically sakash is reaching those souls baba said in today's murli you are the stick for the blind you are the stick for the blind so becoming stick for the blind doesn't mean that to you go and catch every blind person and take him across now blind people are taking other those who are busy in mobile across the road there is a photo like that have you seen <laughs> the blind man what he is doing is he is see this blind man is taking that another guy who is very much busy on mobile across the road <laughs> because he is busy so <laughs> so the fourth thing which is not needed in sakash is time and then fifth energy physical energy energy when i say is physical energy physical energy is not needed you just sit and 
vibrations are going but physical after giving speech for one and half hour you need some rest you can't just go on and on and on and on and on even that tires you if one gives lecture five hours a day one gives ti- one gets tired so mental fatigue happens but for have you ever seen that by giving sakash i have got tired whole night you can spend in giving sakash when is definitely he needs rest but as i said sakash is not the act of doing it is the act of being so actually energy should multiply energy should increase it is not like physical energy like when you consume physical energy it is exhausted but mental is different mensa is different because what you are giving out as pure feelings so giving out pure feelings will never burden the mind logically speaking it is not it cannot happen giving out energy will not deplete the energy ha ah, it is if you are engaged in some intellectual work solving some puzzle you might get tired but we are talking about sending out two definitions blessings and good wishes how can somebody get tired by sending out blessings not possible and then fifth then sixth money money is not needed for mansa seva physical service yes speech yes some amount of preparation is needed you need a hall you need mic you need audience and uh, the room also should be good they should not feel too much cold or too much hot so some amount of money we need to spend we have to spend on verbal service but for mental service for service through the mind money is not needed and then seventh place place is not needed for mental service for verbal service you need certain place where you sit where people sit and then you give start giving speeches but for mansa no space is needed you can stand anywhere you can sit anywhere you can be anywhere in any corner of the world and send out vibrations then it no limitations no limitation in mansa seva there are no limitations in service through speech there are limitations you can't go on talking for 10 hours or 5 hours my, my human mind has capacity after half an hour or 40 minutes unless and until the speaker is very powerful audience can't stand Uh, yeah they can't but yes if it is extraordinarily interesting sometimes they can but not every time still the mind gets fatigued so in mansa seva there are no had no limitations and then in mansa seva uh, there is no competition sparda in physical there can be uh, this physical or verbal service there are competitions but here there are no competitions you can go ahead if you want to become number 1 you can become number 1 but here uh, in all other service there is competitions one center says we have done better decoration others have done lesser decoration we have done better service these are doing lesser service we have got 1000 students they have got 100 students so there is a comparison there is a competition going on two centers in the same city and they are always competing we have called him now we will call somebody better marathi <laughs> no <laughs> something somebody more senior <laughs> so all these things 
and the moment you reach the first thing they tell you is that uh, all dadis have come here and all the maharatis of the centers have been here so we are not just a small gita patshala we are very big so they will definitely tell this so ninth is no sparda and tenth no effort no effort is needed in mansa seva so these are the ten things which are not required in mansa seva what are they we'll just revise first of all <coughs> no time you can do mansa seva any time all time is yours you spend the whole night giving sakash and as again i said you don't give it it is the stage of being automatically it spreads second the first was not in, first was instrument no sadhan is needed no instruments instrument is actually we don't use the word instrument because in gyan in the world for sadhan they use the word instrument but in gyan we have kept the word instrument reserved for nimitt and that's why we have another word facilities or paraphernalia of science so whatever no sadhan is needed in mansa seva but for vacha seva you need mic and many other things or presentation nowadays everybody is projector and doing presentations so and without if you go to some company and if you don't give presentation on this they say oh after long time we heard a speech without any powerpoint i had given a speech so they said uh, you spoke without powerpoint <laughs> <laughs> nowadays nobody speaks without powerpoint they need a powerpoint so that the speaker keeps on seeing there and then the audience and then the he next slides and then the audience and then the next slide and the audience is looking here and there first to him and then his slides and then they look at him and then his slides and the slides are beautiful something coming from above and something going from above something from here and something from there then light and this animation and this transition this effect and that effect <laughs> it's not making them sleeping making the speech interesting but at the end of the speech the it's good it's one of the best means sometimes you can't explain things they understand only by seeing pictures or animations or some videos picture speaks more than that words but still the attention the speaker becomes divided with powerpoint there are two speaker gets divided into two speaker and his presentation so they have two things in front of their eyes though sometimes it needed but sometimes one should go without it so no instrument is needed in mansa seva one second no chance is needed somebody should give me a chance for speech you need chance mansa seva you don't need any chance so no chance no sadhan no adhar no support is needed in mansa seva you don't need anybody's support for anything external support and then no time is needed in mansa seva you can do mansa seva all the time and then no energy consumption physical energy consumption rather the energy increases by doing yoga if somebody says i have done one hour yoga now i am tired how that looks like i have don't i have powerful yoga for one hour and now after doing yoga i am tired just as you say that i have done lot of service today i am tired now even for physical service if somebody says probably that is done in a stage of body consciousness body consciousness in today's murli baba said out of body consciousness they keep on worshiping body they worship the body so time is not needed then energy is not needed and then money is not needed no money for mansa seva you don't need money for physical for physical service and for your vacha service you have to spend some money pamphlets and that flyers and then advertisement and propaganda and mic and hall and uh, ac hmm. banners hoardings so many tolly and so many things and some decoration ah uh, traveling allowances ah huh? 
uh, announcements, so many things. But for Mansa, no money needed. Hmm. And then, place. No place is needed for Mansa Seva. You can sit anywhere, you can stand anywhere, you can be anywhere in the world and do Mansa Seva. But for Vacha Seva, you need place to give speech. You definitely need speech, place. And then, limitations. It has limitations of time, many things. Physical service has got limitation. Mansa Seva has no limitation at all for anything. You can go on and on and on. No had. And then no sparda in Mansa Seva. No competition. No competition is needed. And then, tenth, no effort. What efforts? You have to do a lot of efforts for physical. You have to speaking is an effort. And doing some physical seva is an effort. Karmana seva and vacha seva is an effort. Mehnat. But, Mansa, no efforts. So Baba has given two definitions of Mansa Seva. The first definition is to have good wishes and poor pure feelings. The second definition is Duae. Keep on giving blessings to each and every soul. This is the definition. Two benefits of Mansa Seva. First benefit, your words, energies is not wasted, saved. Verbal energy is saved. And second, Success. You become embodiment of success. So, this is the service that we have to do. Uh, serving through the mind means that you and others automatically feel pure vibrations of having good wishes and pure feelings at every moment for every soul. But there is one clause. Every moment, every soul. This is difficult. Mansa Seva means service for good wishes for every soul. It is very diff- easy to have good wishes for those souls who are far away. But most difficult to have good wishes for those who are around us. For, for In the place where you work. And every moment. Amrit Vela to have good wishes is quite easy. But in the afternoon to have good wishes is difficult. So much traffic is going on. <laughs> that is okay when the somebody is very near to us that time. But as I said, if somebody is very near to A is attached to B and A is giving uh, Sakash to B, it will not reach. Because by way of Sakash, he is in fact remembering that person, just remembering and enjoying his remembrance. <laughs> and outside he is saying, I am giving Sakash. But he is enjoying his life, his company, his words old memories and he's enjoying that person by when outside we are giving Sakash. Sakash is not like that. It is the projection of their attachments. It is the just the projection of their own internal attachment. And outside they are naming it as Sakash. It is not Sakash. The Sakash will never reach. The very criteria for Sakash is total detachment. Unlimited attitude. Sakash means for the whole world not for one person or one family or one state. And that you can do, but Sakash is a very higher stage of consciousness. So these are the different... Yes. Whatever that happens through the mind is Mansa Seva. You are... What? Effort, when I say effort in the sense, I am not... Effort is manat. Mansa Seva, as I said, it is not a stage of doing. It is a stage of being. It is the stage of being. Mansa Seva means, it is not that I am emerging somebody and giving Sakash. Emerging somebody and giving... I am not doing anything. It is just, see the definition of Mansa Seva. Good wishes, pure feeling is Sakash. Blessing is a stage of Mansa Seva. Do you need efforts in giving blessing to anybody? The way you give physical... hmm? Churning is different thing. Churning is different thing. But suppose a mother, does she require any effort to love her child? It is out of the love that is coming out. So that is not needed. Effort in the sense, when I say effort in bracket, physical efforts. Physical efforts are not needed. When I say energy consumption, it is no physical energy. Such a thing is not happening. 
mental energy consumption may not happen it is actually mental energy will increase by giving sakash by doing one hour yoga your power will not decrease it will increase energy conservation also happens because of yoga baba said today's murli religion is might and you have understood it and that's why you are more you are having that power you are having the might om shanti